Uh, what about uh, manifestation? Do you believe in manifestation? Like how to manifest someone, or like how to manifest uh, something? How to manifest specific? someone? <laughs> like how to manifest uh, something or uh, your goal? Oh, so after a long time. <laughs> yeah, after a long time. So how, how are you? you? I'm good. I'm good as usual. Nothing special, you say. Ah, uh, yeah, it's going as usual. And actually, uh, today it was a productive day because mm. I studied a lot, and it was a little bit busy. I was occupied, but yeah, I enjoyed the day. You enjoyed studying? Oh, that's good. Yeah, yeah. People enjoy <laughs> studying also. Great. Yeah, <laughs> and yeah. what about you? What's new? What's new? It's it's so cold. I feel so bad every single day. I'm cursing this weather. Mm. Yeah, Actually, yes. like anything. Ah, uh, because uh, today is a uh, like today is going like nowadays it's going on winter. So today is little bit uh, not so cold, but yeah, it was cloudy. That's why maybe. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. okay. So, which is your favorite subject, and which subject did you study today? Uh, I studied reasoning, but my favorite subject is English, as usual. Like I, I used to like this subject since my childhood. Mm-hmm. I was very bad in English. Uh, slowly, slowly, I am developing myself. In the subject, and nowadays I am practicing English. So English is a, for me, is a fascinating subject. I love learning English. Apart from that, as I am preparing government exams, so I have to prepare reasoning and quants. That is math. Okay. Yeah. Also, yeah, I have studied math also today. Okay. You have been preparing for so many months. So when is your exam? Hmm. Yeah, actually, banking exams will be starting probably June or July month. But okay. there are a lot of um, insurance exams are in the pipeline. So let's see. I will be appearing for those exams also because uh, syllabus are more or less same. Syllabus is same. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God. Okay. I feel you know I meet lot of people preparing for government exams and I feel empathetic for them because somewhere they also know that ha huh, it's it's good to think about it but the probability is there but ah, you know what true, I'm saying right true. yeah yeah because actually uh, I am focusing on state exam but yeah, yeah I have to appear for uh, com- uh, government banking exams those are probably uh, all India basis so. Yeah. Let's say yeah, competition is hard. Hmm. Uh, but let's see. Let's see. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're holding hope against hope, but why only banking exam? Why not UPSC? Oh, UPSC. That's a very tough exam. You know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, like I actually there is a lot of uh, there are a lot of difference between the syllabus. And also subjects there. And first of all, I want to crack any exam. Then, uh, like working there, I will try different jobs also. Because I should not stop learning, and also I should not stop uh, YouTubing. That is my passion. And speaking English with you people, with different tutors. So I will do. I will be busy. I like. I will keep myself busy in learning yeah, something. Yeah. Right. But one thing I was thinking: Do you also have the superficial thought that once you get a government job, then life will be sorted and you'll be able to enjoy and everything will be perfect? Do you think like that or not? Mm, to be honest with you, uh, somehow I think like that. But yeah, if I get a government job or if i get a decent job in future then there will be another problem or there will be another 
sort of things that will come to you your life and then you have to like fight because uh, like that's the thing that that motivates me a lot like you have to fight like otherwise there is no existence of yourself i believe that and to fight and also to struggle for existence that's the motto i think and also uh, like mm, somehow though this year started with great disaster in my life but mm, i will get back to on the track uh, because there are a lot of opportunities and uh, let's see like like i have the whole year so i will be prepared for that okay like anything serious if you come uh, you can uh serious means uh, like uh, health issues and all uh, my especially my health is health is not well uh, but and also some like i am i am preparing for exams and i'm not cracking so sometimes uh, depression is there so it's a part of life and uh, let's see <laughs> to be honest with you let's see like i'm i don't want to be a loser so i will keep fighting oh my god that's great that's great <laughs> Yeah. That's great, you know. You can. Um, I mean, this is the only thing which you can do is to fight and face the situation, mm. right? Yeah, right? I mean, we can't do anything. Things happen, so we have to let mm. go and. Because uh, uh, whatever I have or in my hand, I can fight for them, right? I can't mm. do for someone's in hand because uh, those yeah. things are in their hand, so they mm. can regulate it. But whatever I have, I can control it. so i think that um, let's see i have to fight for myself for my existence mm-hmm. yeah, yeah 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 absolutely that's the only thing which you can do because there are a lot of uncontrollable factors factors so we cannot change those yeah and one thing i just uh, want to uh, i want suggestion from you uh, like uh, if you have any experience on this then you can share me Uh, like how to um, when you are very stressed or mm. when something that uh, like a very unavoidable situation happened or unexpected situation happened which is very bad mm. so how to or like what do do then or anything happened yeah a lot of times but i usually don't do anything because if anything happens then i i lose my ability to think properly so sometimes yeah. i impulsively do something or i message that person i start you know doing something which is not appropriate so i feel it's very important for us to calm our self calm down ourselves and see what helps you uplift your mood maybe eat your favorite mm-hmm. food and maybe dance or maybe talk to somebody who can uh, please you or comfort you after doing that then you sit down and then you will get a different perspective so impulsively something happens don't react at all take the time take the time to understand and then mm-hmm. see that what what can be done if there is something which you cannot do let it be let that thing be you do just what you can yeah but uh, like uh, because uh, it's a common nature or it's a basic nature of human beings like we want rapid result yes. so what's on your point of view of this absolutely i am a po- i am a person i do not have patience but i feel that life wants me to be patient so until i am not patient i don't get what i want so that particular thing will get delayed and delayed but when i stop thinking about that thing that thing will come to me or i will be able to achieve it so there is this thing that you have to be patient if you are not patient you might not get the desired result or you you might not be able to survive with the situation so i mean you can write journal whatever you're feeling feel it and take a pen and a notebook and make yourself understand this is right i should be doing that <laughs> like that okay that's good and so okay manifestation Yeah, it's one of the hot topics these days, right? On internet. 
Mm. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is one of the trendy topics. Manifestation mm. is something. It happens, but uh, it should be accompanied with hard work and efforts and attempts. But one thing is for sure that uh, you want to manifest someone. I don't think so that happens, but you can definitely manifest things in life. Okay, suppose you want to crack government exam, so you can be positive and continuously work hard, work hard. Then one day it will happen. So there are a lot of things, but I think we should just focus on our karma. That's it. We should not go deep into manifestation, manifestation, because if you go deep into it, then you will not be able to take action because you will feel, oh, my manifestation is happening. Why should I work? Why should I go to gym? Why should I? You will be writing affirmations and all the techniques only. So I think it's not good. Mm, that's true. Like, ah, uh, you have to take actions. Like, there, if there is no action, there is no nothing will happen. That's it. Mm, so yeah, that's. What about you? Like, you believe or not? Ah, uh, actually, I didn't try. Ah, uh, till now, but ah, uh, I think that I have to try for this year. Ah. Uh, okay. So there are a lot of because I have a lot of dreams. So, ah, uh, one by one, I have to complete. Oh. So, yeah, it's going on. So, right. let's see, like. I, Like in Turkey will be there, so I will meet you sure. <laughs> in Turkey. Yeah, and also I will share my uh, whatever goals I have set, and if I complete it, then I will definitely talk about that. Yeah, yeah, definitely do not leave English Turkey because I feel that we have been speaking for seven eight months now. So mm. I think, yeah. Yeah, 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 and also yeah, uh, to talk about uh, like to talk with. Uh, Like people who are familiar with yeah. me or with someone, they did be a very friendly conversation, and it would be uh, so easy to understand, and it is very interesting. So with different topics, so yeah, yeah, absolutely, because we develop a connection, a very good yeah, yeah. foundation also, and we don't have to be formal, right? So yeah, 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 that's good. Yeah. Right. yeah, sometimes. But for the manifestation things, I think you should be positive. And if you really want to go in the field of manifestation, you should definitely try out affirmations and all. It will keep your mood uplifted and help you always focus in your goal. Yeah, the ultimate. Ah, uh, yeah, that's true. And the ultimate truth is you have to take actions. Otherwise, nothing will happen, and nobody can do for you. You uh, only the man you uh, can do for you. That is you. Right. Correct. Good. Hmm. And it is very, uh, like it is very interesting to talk to you always. And I think that time is running out. Or do you? Yes. Do I have? Yeah, time is running. Yeah, yeah. You have a uh, one minute because recording is not matching with the okay. timing. Okay. Okay. Yes, yeah, so yeah. I'll give the full feedback. Then you can go. Mm hmm. Have, sure. Are sure. you done with your dinner? Oh no! I will have uh, around 10 p.m. What about you? Yeah, I just cooked noodles. It's so cold oh. over here. So best thing I can eat. Okay, and yeah, can you cook? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can cook basic, basic. Basic things like to survive well. That's very yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What good, about good, you? That's good. Ah, uh, yeah, I can cook the basic things, and I love cooking. I try to cook different uh, food in my spare time. Hmm. I, actually, I love cooking, so I will try sometimes different food. Okay. And can you make chapatis, round chapatis? Oh my God, no, that's a hard <laughs> job. I think I did. I didn't try, uh, but I can uh, cook rice hmm. and okay. pals. That's the Perfect. basic things I can do. Perfect. Okay, talking about your feedback part, I think you were little occupied with the exams and all with the preparation. You are speaking mm. well today, but I think this is the best time you can uh, upgrade your language by introducing more new new words. Okay, because your level sure. is has become little stagnant, so you should be mm. moving to another level. Okay, maybe oh, work, maybe yeah, use. Focus. on 
like upgrade to upgrade myself yeah yeah definitely that's what you need to do otherwise you're good okay thank you thank you right then bye have your dinner good night yeah okay good night bye take care bye you too